Okay, we live, fam. Gonna reshare this to Twitter. There we go. Alright, we are playing some Resistance 3. I recently picked this game up not too long ago. Uh, I did a Renegade plays of Resistance 1. I also want to say I, I might be interrupted by noise. So, uh, here's, here's hoping that doesn't happen, but whatever. Also, shut up, Brendan. Uh, where the fuck am I now? I forgot. Oh, giant dust storm. I remember. I saw this cutscene, so let me skip it. Go eat ass. As an insult, I mean... If it's a fine female, I will gladly eat ass. But, yeah. I, I think that's pretty good. I think that will be a compliment for me. Are we on boats now, fam? Oh, my, my PS3 controller is borked. So you might... I might not be able to sprint because I'm an old fucking man. And my balls are made of ice blocks, and I might not be able to sprint because of it. Oh, that's a journal. Alright, never mind. Well, it's true. This is normal difficulty, by the way. I'm not playing on Superhuman, so fuck that. I, I would, though, just to try it, because I did play Resistance 1 on hard, and... It's a challenge for sure. Beaumont, Texas. We're about to scout people down in the deep country of Texas. My country is shaped like a hat. And there's fucking Camara eggs, I think. They look so different. Oh, there's the stupid babies. I forgot about those. The river through this mill. What the fuck, Brenda? <laughs> yeah, all that's being shown on screen. So this time I am not talking to myself. This time I have a crazy man in here. A crazy Indian. So you know the deal. Also, Look, Joseph, Weapon Will is back. Right because they took this out in the second game for God knows what. What the fuck? Is that like fucking someone's carcass? What the fuck? Oh, it's a giant. It looks like a giant eel, man. That's disgusting. Uh, let's see. Ammo box. Oh, I am stocked up. All right. What's that? I'm getting scared now. Too much fucking tension. This is going on forever, by the way. I don't. I don't know, fam. Resist this, nigga. <laughs> I got a shotgun now? Come on, just stop handing me guns. I'm overpowered. Oh, shit. I can't switch the gun either. Oh, I have to test it out, so... Uh, these babies can fuck off. Concussion grenades. Let's see. Oh, not bad. There's no merchant in this game, so fuck off. There is no merchant. I wish, though. If I was drunk, maybe I would put a bullet in his face. But I'm not. I'm not drunk right now. I am perfectly sober. Perfectly human. The Goliath. What the fuck's that? What's that green thing up there? I don't know what's going on, fam. Can I shoot it? No. 
What are you buying? What are you selling? I need to play RE4 again, by the way. Because that game is fun. Even though oh, I forgot all about it on Professional. I just remember, like, Krauser. He was easy, but... I'm probably rusty now, so... I will die a lot. Look, I, I am sober, okay? I'm not talking about whatever I was talking about on stream. I'm not talking about big giant titties. I am perfectly human. I will try to push through. Perhaps the shotgun could help break up the ice. Oh, I gotta play Titanic now. Alright, alright. Now I got low ammo. Come on. Come on, man. Where's the indicator? I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Okay, here we go. Try to break it. Oh, I have to reload. At least you get like semi infinite ammo. There is a infinite ammo code in this game, but you have to the way to get cheats is kind of weird. I, well, not really, because Uncharted did the same thing where you have to, like, buy it. And if you have enough points, you can get infinite ammo pretty early. Fuck that. Yeah, the water is shallow, but we must keep moving. All this shaking is scaring me, fam. This has to be a calm before the storm level. Here we go. Where where is the enemies? Come on. What's that? Okay. Oh, I remember these enemies, the skinny the skinny slow poke idiots. I remember them. I think they only really intimidate you if they get closer. Oh, and they are jumping on the bow, so I better bring out that shotgun. <laughs> are those Brian's children? I, I don't know. Ask him. Uh, he's had a lot of ugly babies. If these are his kids, but I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna question it. I'm just not going to. Yes, I know Malakar. I look. I first of all, first of all, I am not as zero calorie diet as these motherfuckers. These enemies are super skinny. Like I, I I'm not, I'm not, I'm not Dom over here. I'm not pale and I'm not gray. No, I'm just kidding. Also, that that's a low blow crawl space. Why you gotta do me like that, dog? Now, now I I, I know that maybe you are into Momokun, but now's not the time to talk about that thought. Also, there is a progression. Oh my god, holy shit, hold on. Back back up, please. I'm getting I'm getting mauled, but there is a progression system where you can if you kill an enemy with a gun over a certain period of time, it levels up. I kinda like that because you know, just engages you more than just buying shit off the spot. Also, Capelli cannot regenerate health like the previous protagonist Nathan Hell. Uh, because he's not a, I think he's not infected with the Camarin virus anymore. So that means that you have to complain like Angry Joe and say, you know, picking up health packs in a first person shooter is stupid. I don't see it as a big deal, obviously. Although I really do need health right now. Can I can I break this? No, I cannot. I don't like I don't like okay. 
It depends when it comes to what form of woman we're talking about here. Like, morbidly obese? No. But, you know, meat on the bones, some curves. Um, when her thigh looks like a fine turkey, then, you know, maybe. Maybe, maybe that's fine. But if she's like Boogie 2.0, hell, hell no. That is unsanitary. Oh my god, I'm about to die from that joke too. There we go. I, I need some health right now. Come on, can you hook a brother up? Can you, can you do something? Oh damn, somebody got banned? Well... No, timed out. Okay. I was <laughs> like, I didn't know what happened. <laughs> but, you know, it's all jokes with me. I I'm not drunk. I swear. I if I was drunk this time, I, I think what will happen is I will probably want to jump off the boat. Which... <laughs> I haven't done, so I'm, I'm pretty good. Damn, want to hear a joke, Fred. The master of chicken nuggets. You know, I swear, ever since that motherfucker, like, that shit happened, I will sworn off chicken nuggets. Like, every time I see them in the supermarket, I get repulsed. I'm like, I, I, can't, I can't get behind all this. Also, there is a health pack in the back of the boat, which I did not know. So I guess you could clarify that as a drunk moment. I'm not too sure. Yeah, yeah, I, drunk moment. Let's, let's go with that. What the fuck is this Terminator shit? Oh, oh no. Oh, no, Thor. Go right back to Asgard. Oh shit, these things hurt. Man, this guy is speaking Satilia's language. Mm -mm. I, I don't think I don't think I'll eat chicken nuggets as long as I live. Well, maybe. Ne never say never, but right now I'm like, I see it. I'm repulsed. I'm turned off. It's like seeing a box of AIDS. I, I just can't do it. Is that enemy stalk or... Son of a bitch, I have to go around. Stop hurting so much, please. Okay, we good. <laughs> oh, man. I see Brian going ham in the chat right now. It appears we have found the river. According to my map, we are now on the Mississippi. The city of St. Louis should be close. Savagery from the moss tonight. Okay, can I get back to dry land because... Wait, can you jump off the boat? No, you can't. Alright. I'm reading what uh Brandon is saying. Oh No. Okay, I said this before, but Momokun, her face is pretty. She has a pretty face, but her attitude is shit, and her body is like, I don't know, it's like a bag of leaves. Like, don't, don't, if you have imperfections, just go with it. Don't Photoshop your titties. Don't Photoshop your mounds of tuna. Leave, leave that shit there. Be genuine for once in your life about your your giant rag tags i mean you don't have to censor that be proud of it but no it's like i'm gonna photoshop a vein here 
I'm gonna Photoshop a vein there. I'm gonna put my ex's DMs out in public. That's not cute. That is some, that is some frivolous witch shit. And I just made that up. <laughs> I don't. Uh, I don't think I can shoot this giant behemoth. So I'm sorry. I I'm sorry, but I, I don't think I could put a dent in the giant stalker, Goliath, whatever the fuck. I think the stalker is the smaller version. But back to the game, Resistance is, I played this for a while. I liked the first game, I thought it was great, but color palette kind of annoys me. Gray and dark, drab, green. I don't like that color palette, uh, but I thought it was good. Hell, as a protagonist, he's just basic. The basic military man going in a dangerous mission. And it doesn't get better from there with the second game because while I did enjoy some aspects, they kind of gimped it a little bit with the whole, oh, you can only pick up two weapons now. You have like all these crazy sci-fi weapons being used and you can only pick up two. And it really, I hated the whole one hit kill enemies. Also, I think this boat is going down. Like, there's enemies at the end that can kill you in one hit. And it's like, I can't react fast enough. Also, the frame rate is going crazy. I need to get this health box. No! No. Oh, there we go. Yes! One HP clutch. And Resistance 3 is really good, but apparently it's short. Which is the only problem. So it's like, ah, shit. Bible Black, what the fuck is going on in Bible Black? I did see the dub where some guys like, oh, it's so embarrassing to talk about Bible Black on live stream. Why am I doing it? But I guess you could say the dub has the most masculine men on the planet with how they speak to women. It's like, come here, bitch. Make me come now, damn it. I don't know why people watch this shit. Like, god damn. It's like the most hilariously funny thing I've seen in ages. Although, I'm pretty sure if I react to that, my channel's gonna get demonetized or something. I don't. I don't <laughs> yeah, YouTube's not gonna like that. I have rice on my face. What the fuck? I'm not I'm not a rice eater, okay? Well, yeah, I am because a lot of Xbox people, they like to use that as an insult. And I'm like, I fucking love rice. It's great. It feeds my soul, so just because I like Japanese games, I'm a rice eater. And I'm fine with that. Also, oh, why am I using a shotgun from that range? I just noticed that. There we go. Hold that loaf. Wait. Do a little tag because uh, the long legs can be annoying. Oh, I missed. Fuck. Cool. Well, we're safe now, Captain. Come on, Captain. Mon nigga, we're safe. What the f person X always loves to shit post and make the live stream ten times more weird. Look, I want to stay far away from drill. I, I don't know where that man has been. He's been harvesting Joy Cons up his ass, so I, I don't know. Keep him far away from me. <laughs> Shout out to Drill though. You're cool, fam, but seriously, I, I don't know. That that just speaking of like Nintendo people personally, having them in my comments is kinda weird. Cause it's like, yeah, I'm getting a Switch, but somehow buying one means I held an L for some reason. It's super weird. It's like I said I was gonna get a Switch like a year ago. And the only game I really want to play is like No More Heroes, maybe Bayonetta 3. 
Uh, but something tells me, like, with all Bayonetta games, I'm not gonna get that at launch. Also, how the f I can't fight this giant, colossal, mega, transformer Rex nigga. I can't do anything. Is that a death or... No. I can't tell. Man, that boat got fucked. That was a death. It's like, what? <laughs> what? What do I do against this giant dude? Good God. All right, let me pay attention. Oh wait, I know what I gotta do. Oh, put it out. Go, fam, go. Ah! Okay, this is crazy. I can't damage that guy. <laughs> I might be stuck here for a minute till I get it. Resistance on Switch. Never, because from what I've seen, Sony is pretty. Man, they have like their exclusives locked down. Oh, okay. Cutscene. Good. Somehow I died before, even though I was supposed to trigger the cutscene? That's fucking weird. I guess you were supposed to, like, last a little bit longer until the boat finally gets blown up. But prematurely, I got fucked. I mean, it makes sense, considering that their exclusives, you know, if they pay for them... A lot of people are freaking out about that shit about Spider-Man, and it's like, stop, you know. Just, fam, you got till, like, September. And then there's, like, Black Friday deals, Cyber Monday. There's no way that someone can tell me they can't get Spider-Man if they went out and bought, like, an Xbox One X for, like, 500 bucks. I'm like, what the fuck? Well, okay, then. <laughs> it's like, all right. 500 is like fucking a console and two or three games. Fuck off, Sing. Go, go blow up a building. Oh, more eggs? I will destroy them. Oh, and you take damage because they are plasma this time around. That's rich. Also, how long have I been streaming? Okay, so I got like about a couple more minutes. Gonna stream for like an hour. The power of the Xbox One. Dom's quoting me. Someone's quoting me because I saw the Infinite Ammo text account. <laughs> Don't Photoshop your mouths of tuna. <laughs> I mean, like, it's fine. I, I just don't like when people lie about being broke when they buy a very expensive console where I think the Xbox One X actually went on sale for, like, 300 recently. It was a deal. I saw it, and I'm like, well, the people who bought the console at 500 they held a loaf. Sometimes it's better to wait because shit goes on sale and then you're gonna be thinking like god damn i paid like 60 bucks for this game and it's on sale for like five dollars a few months later also where do i go what do i do sir there's no mission indicator either do i shoot this old guy in the fucking head oh he can't die never mind Uh, let me see. Is there a way in the train yard over here? This bitch is looking at something. I don't know what.
Let me see. Let me switch to the auger. Okay, there's a way in somewhere. That's pretty obvious, too. This way. Danger infested. No shit. The world's most powerful console. The Xbox One X. Um... Man, so many people got duped. It's quite crazy. 4K gaming. It's like, oh my god, I I totally don't care about 4K. It's it's irrelevant. Also, I'm getting quoted, so you might hear my phone. Am I stuck? What the fuck? Okay. It's like the Xbox is better used for toilet paper than playing actual games. Like you can shove the controller sideways up your ass. The giant duke because they keep releasing controllers. Yo, I heard inside Xbox was garbage. <laughs> like the only thing people cared about is Elder Scrolls Moral Wind backwards compatible. And that's about it. It's like, man, I said this a few days ago, but how are we going, like, backwards compatibility is great. It's a great option, but how are we going backwards and not forward? Like, don't you need both? I, I don't understand. It's kind of weird. I love old games, but <laughs> I'm not going to get excited about Grand Theft Auto 4. And I played that game, like, years ago and beat it. Oh, holy bug, nigga. <laughs> what is that? Yo, that's a new Camara. i never seen that one before. Okay, we, we're strapped. Yo, uh, Malakoff, I'm calling it, he's gonna die. Because, you know, ain't no old person gonna be fighting in an apocalypse. And he ain't gonna live. Look, he's saying he's old as shit. He's older than fucking two chestnut balls. He's fucking old. And he's gonna die. Old people die in post-apocalyptic shooters. It's just common. Now... I don't know, my man Joel, he might have a chance in Last of Us Part 2, but he's pushing it. He's like 60, he's like almost 65, man. He's pushing like Solid Snake age. So I don't, I don't know, he might be whooping motherfuckers with a cane, who knows. Hello, Mr. Sonata, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Playing some Resistance 3 uh, to kill time because right now I don't have much to do. Also, that's a lot of blood. Okay. Warning infested. No shit. <laughs> Stop writing that. Okay, here we go. What's behind door number two? dark as fuck in here have i played dragon's dogma um not as long as i want it to also i have a new gun uh i played it like for about two hours and i put it down i think the game is pretty good but i just wasn't really like invested into the story i heard the story was bad anyway but I mean, to me, that's irrelevant because the gameplay matters most, so I might give it a try later on in the future. Again. Oh, oh my god, this place looks ugly. Oh, 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 you're looking ugly right now. Oops, I threw a grenade by accident. Uh, 
I don't see anyone else up here. What the fuck? Man. Stop emerging from that pussy. Shit. Oh, there's a lot of them. Ow. Hold, hold that. Oh, yes. I am the god of thunder. He's stuck, too. He can't move. Look at him. Yo, this weapon is broken. What the fuck? This shit lasts forever. Ow, okay. Hold on, I'm about to drop another one. There we go. No effort, the gun. <laughs> That's pretty much what it is. It's like, I don't gotta do shit. I can sit back and watch them fry. Let them cook. Look, Sing Long is like... I don't know. He's the god of Arabian dicks, I guess. <laughs> it's like saying, are, 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 I'm not trying to be racist, but are you like Punjabi? Do you like uh, curry sauce and rice? And do, do you like rice in your chili? That, that's what I want to know. That's the burning question of Renegade Operative. Do you like rice in your chili? Because if you are into that stuff, then I don't know, fam. I have to question your sexuality. <laughs> I'm just saying. I don't know. Someone said that on Twitter, like, I eat chili and rice, and then I put chili and rice on my hot dogs and i'm like what the fuck and i saw i saw a person that's get tied down <laughs> i'm about to die and i'm like laughing so hard oh have that grenade P please fam because oh all right there we go <laughs> person that's got timed out for like 600 seconds oh i'm getting quoted again I think chili is okay, but I don't know. That's some weird alien concoction. Like hot dogs, chili, and rice? I don't know, fam. That's like too much. You're, you're like killing a fucking hot dog. Like Momokun kills a dick. <laughs> Just reading the chat. <laughs> Oh, I, I guess I gotta kill these guys before I progress. Also, one thing I like about this game is um, I like the fact that shit fuck testicles. I, I like the fact that the game tells you how long it takes before you get a certain trophy. Uh, I would love the platinum in this game, but unfortunately you cannot if you don't have like Another player playing local co-op, which is a bummer. Do you like rice in your pussy? Oh, that sounds like that sounds like some weird. Ooh, porn, pe like, fucking parody or something. I don't know. <laughs> it's like, I don't know about that. Oh, what was it? I'm about to say something weird, but a couple of days ago, I saw some parody for a porno for Dragon Ball Z. And there's this bitch dressed like a lima bean, dressed like Piccolo. The full-on antennas, the full-on green face paint. I'm like, bruh, you looking like the Incredible Hulk right now, fam. What are you doing? Didn't your mother love you as a child? What? Come on. 
I saw that shit and I'm like, I'm done. <laughs> I'm like, I'm just fucking done, dude. Oh my god. They ruined my childhood, which was Dragon Ball Z. It's like, thanks a lot. Okay, the catwalk is down. I am very scared of the internet. That is true. Like, every time I see some weird stuff, I always get amazed because the next day, someone manages to pop my expectations of weird shit. The next thing you know, there's going to be like a porno on fucking Avatar, The Last Airbender, and that's assuming that there's not porn on that already because fucking rule 34 so yeah <laughs> it's quite unfortunate but that's what happens because it's the internet hold on hold this secondary fire oh my jesus christ that explosion i love it oh yes there is there is a uh, some questionable things about our favorite cartoons out there online. I've seen them. And uh, unfortunately, Avatar falls under that category because people have nothing else to do with their time. <laughs> I'm about to die. I'm about to die talking about pornography. Why? Have that grenade, please. Oh! Two more. There we go. Deaf to humans. Deaf to the ISA scope. Speaking of kill zone, I have to play the second one eventually. So I maybe I'll do it on live stream because I heard kill zone was great. Brian's ball. Like, okay. He actively avoids Rogaine. I, I don't know. I, I don't know why. Like, it would help you, fam. Like, you might have a full head of hair. And they're trying to help you out. You know, you could put a beaver on your head. That might work. But it's like, come on. Grow, grow some hair on that bald head. Cause I, I don't want to be bald. I'm telling you now, I, I fear male pattern baldness. And I feel if that happened to me, I would just jump into a river because my hair is, is, is perfect. Perfect hair forever. No, I'm kidding. No, I'm kidding. Although I thought that show was garbage, but that's besides the point. <laughs> I have a forehead that rivals Johnny Sins. All right. It's it's kind of crazy how <laughs> It's kind of crazy how my forehead is like normal and someone made a joke about it. So I I don't know. I guess people are into that maybe. The forehead game is strong. <laughs> Let's see, roasting going on now. Also, I found the far eye. No, dead eye. They changed the name. All right. But your typical routine sniper rifle. And what the fuck is that? Death Stranding. Before it became Death Stranding. I missed. Wait, headshot? Maybe? The fuck is this hungry man still alive for? Throw a rock at me. All right, no, nah. this is not fucking Assassin's Creed where like <laughs> if you run on the side of a wall in Assassin's Creed one, they start throwing rocks and you fucking just fall over. I thought that shit was stupid. It's like, there he is. There, 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 there he is. Let's throw a rock. Totally knocks him off balance and you fall into the water and you die. 
Man, I hate Assassin's Creed 1. Oh my god. Can I can I roast that game? Because I, I fucking hate it. Like, I played Assassin's Creed 2 and I'm like, yo, this game is lit. What happened? Like, I know they had the foundation. They had to make the foundation of making Assassin's Creed 1 even better with 2, but 1 was not a good game. Holy crap. Also, what the fuck? I see Bathtub Boy being mentioned. I'm not gonna go there. <laughs> I'm not gonna go there. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna say I roasted that guy enough. He's, he's the guy throwing rocks at me right now. Come here with your sad ass. Come on. Throw another one because I don't know where you are. Oh, all the way up there. I I don't know. I just like other Assassin's Creed games besides well, not Unity because I heard that was some trash, but I mean, two Brotherhood, great games, mint, but Unity and Assassin's Creed One, nah. Let's see, Bullseye. Oh, more infants. Man, Brian, he's doing a lot of. Damage control. What's going on, fam? I mean, I, I I would just post a picture of a bowling ball and say, you know, that's his father or something. Because if you look at the back of his head, it makes sense. The Lord is black. <laughs> okay, can we talk about how Dragon Ball Super was intentional, intentionally racist? Uh, with Trunk saying this man isn't black. I think Funimation knew what they were doing. Absolutely, because so far they avoided all the lines from the original dub or sub, so to speak. And then they included that one. And it's like, yep, I, I see what you did there, fam. <laughs> you, tried, you tried to... People are going to take that out of context, and they already did. But to me, it's funny. As a black man. Also, these guys do a lot of damage for babies. Shit. I need to heal, like, really bad. I, I know. I, I know. I'm, I know I'm super black. I, I, I already know. I'm, I, I mean... There's friends that I have that's blacker than me. I mean, they might be full-blown shadows. Worse than the fucking cats from Devil May Cry 1, but that's besides the point. The point is, if you are so black that the Kinect cannot pick you up, then that's a problem. Like, <laughs> Microsoft, what were you doing there? <laughs> like... I know, I know the Xbox Connect was a failure, but you don't have to be racist. Okay, now I see just slander. Baby enemies and FPS games are super annoying, even in third-person shooters. Uh, because I was playing Dead Space 2 on Hardcore, or uh, Nightmare, whatever they call it. Bro, that part where you have to go into the elementary portion and fight all those toddler baby necromores and you have like no ammo. I'm like, what do I do? I got to stomp these motherfuckers because I have no weapons. I have no, I, I, like nightmare mode. They give you barely any ammo. So I had to punch my way out. I'm like, what do I like shit? It's like 50 babies and one Isaac Clark, so what do I do? I gotta punch my way out. <laughs> and somehow I beat that part. I am so dead, yep. 
bastard came behind me. Oh man, Dead Space, such a great franchise. But EA, EA, you fucked it up really, really, really hard with Dead Space 3. Um, I think that's the only, ironically, that's the only Dead Space game I never really beat. It's the third game. It's like, I played it a little bit with a co-op partner, and I'm like, yeah, I'm done. I, I don't, I don't like this game that much. Brian asked me to join the KKK. Uh, first of all, first of all, like, I don't know, me being, me being, well, then again, it does remind me of that scene in Mafia 3 where, you know, there's the KKK mission. I'm not sure if, uh, Link and Clay dresses up like them, but maybe, you know, I'll get a free pass. <laughs> Stop this guy. <laughs> But yeah, I, I, I don't know. I, I have to, I have to take a rain check on that one. Also, is this enemy gonna come behind me or not? Cause last time was some fuckery. Oh, I'm gonna have to get the bullseye out for him because he's being annoying. Shit, I missed. Oh, got him. Also, boy, I am telling you that Spider-Man gameplay, every time they show something, I'm like, yeah, th this might be my game of the year. <laughs> I can't, I, I, I can't help it, no lie, like, I do have criticisms, like, I'm not too fond about the whole idea of playing with Mary Jane, because I think maybe those sections are going to be boring. But if they aren't, I mean, I would welcome it. I have a pretty open mind. But everything else with Spider-Man is ridiculous. It's good. I, I love it. Yes, we was Kangs. I know. Hey, I'm, I'm with you there, brother. I know. <laughs> oh, no, I'm just kidding, though. Oh, I can zip over there. All right, let's do it. We was Kings, nigga. We was we was Chimera, nigga. Yo, if they said that or something, I would die in this game. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not like lying. I would laugh my ass off. Oh no. Okay, you have an auger. You want to play? You want to play hardball? I can do that. Yo, what does get me from the side? Holy crap! All right, so it seems like standard resistance difficulty. If you get flanked, you're dead. But I, 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 I can get behind this. Hey, I, I, I know I die. I accept it. I'm not like other people where it's like, I'm going to throw my controller through a wall. I just have to get better. But it seems like standard resistance stuff. If you get flanked, you're dead. Also, someone is flanking me right now, which... Come the fuck. Come on. I have no auger ammo. That's not good. Ooh, that's not good. There's a song on YouTube named after me. What the? Someone, someone clarify what that is. Cause, I mean, there's no music worse than Kids Move. Let's 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 be honest. This 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 dude made a song about Halo, Gears, and Forza. <laughs> the only Xbox games that apparently a lot of people are into, but you know, for a console with no exclusives, I I can see, fam. I I can see why someone would make that song. Like. You know, it's like the only three. <laughs> Halo Gears is Forza, the only three. Hit the like button. No, we're not on YouTube. I thought we boycotted YouTube like live streams. 
See, we're on Twitch where you have to, like, get a really, really hot chick to pull her tits out. And then we'll be talking. Then I will, like, make, like, a thousand dollars on live stream. Just get that hot ass chick, make her dance, put a whiteboard up. You know? <laughs> I will be rolling in money, man. Everybody would donate. Uh, but seriously, I, I have, I mean, if you want to sex sales, if you want to do that, that's fine. But it's crazy how many times Twitch changed their rules because of that. So weird, dude. No, I'm not drunk. I'm just very talkative. Uh, if I was drunk, I probably would be just gone. I would be saying everything. <laughs> I'd be like, you know what? Fucking... I'll be like tits or gay or something like that. I don't know. Someone said that today. I think one of my uh, one of my friends said that, and I'm like, what the fuck? Okay. Do I watch anime? Of course. I I just don't. I need to watch Full Metal Alchemist. I'm behind. I really need to watch Brotherhood because I'm so fucking behind on that. Oh no, he's right there. Why can't I kick him or something? What a bitch. Uh, where's the auger? Help me. Oh wait, health. Thank, thank the Lord. I'm going in the back. I'm not drunk, dude. Like, my best friend said that today. And I'm like, okay. that's. But that's something I would say if I was drunk. Like, immediately, and then everyone on the live stream will be like, what the, what is this dude talking about? <laughs> like, he's talking about tits or gay. But, that's, that's exactly what would be said if someone's drunk, because they have, like, no recourse. Oh, no, I, I, I don't know about that Love Live stuff, though. I mean, yeah, maybe it brings me back to that video where I said fucking, I'm not even saying it because love live is trash and whoever likes it, you are garbage. Also, I just Superman punched that guy. Hey, you, over here. Am I David Hogg? No. <laughs> Who the hell is David Hogg? Never heard of him. You have a question. Shoot. Look, Dante can't feel insulted because this is not Devil May Cry where I can do like 80,000 uh, juggles and combos and stuff like that. But I do need to play DMC on stream again because it was fun. It really was, but I don't know. I'm not, I'm not really confident in my Devil May Cry 4 abilities with Dante because it's been so long. I'm rusty. Maybe with other characters, but not with Dante, no. I suck with Dante now. Oh, you're talking, yeah, you're talking about that Dante. Okay, I haven't seen him in a while. I think it's because I've just been busy. I have not attended Dante's live streams, but they are usually pretty hilarious, so I would recommend uh, searching up Mr. Dante Comstock and hearing what he has to say because sometimes he's drunker than I am and I find that to be quite ridiculous this man is drunk while sober can, can we go with that drunk while sober <laughs> it works also there's this guy shooting me from above you need to die fam okay no 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 we're not, we're not playing a game. Yes, fuck you. Oh shit. Oh, who was hitting me? Who, who was doing that? Nope. You should make a parody called Renku no Pandico. I don't like fucking pandas. I don't like animals. Animals suck. They they shit on your carpet and then you have to clean it up. 
End of story. Oh, have that grenade. Fuck! I'm dead. No, it's so many enemies here. Fucking hell, man. <laughs> Am I fighting Zuckerberg's family origin? Oh man, yo, I totally rage quit Facebook. I'm like, I'm done. I just. At first, it was good. Then my page got like hacked. And I'm like, well, I lost all my contacts. And I told everyone, like, just fucking, if you care, just text me. You have my number, just ask for it. Just fucking do anything because I'm tired of Facebook. I'm tired of Skype. I, I just moved on. Skype is trash, 100%. All I get is spam. So, so I told everybody like, fucking add me on Discord because I'm not coming back. That, that's it. I'm done. If we do like some interviews for gaming, uh, people better get used to Google Hangouts because I'm, I'm not going back. That's it. That's a wrap. Here we go. Wild Wild West. That shit was not worth it either. I took damage for that. Oh, this dude with the auger is a faggot. No. Oh. oh, he's dead. Never mind. But yeah, Skype is garbage. And you know the funny thing is... For some weird reason, like I clicked on Skype business. Yes, my bullseye is upgraded. Fear me, bitch, fear me. But I clicked on Skype business and I can't get it off my computer. They won't let me uninstall it. I'm like, what the fuck? How? So I gotta find some way to get it off. Cause it's not. It keeps popping up, and I'm like, why are you here? Why are you running? Why are you running? <laughs> it's like, <laughs> I can't get it off my damn PC. Oh, no. No, 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 no. You looking for somebody? Uh, health pack would be nice. A black man said I suck ass at this game. Uh, this game is not resistance is not easy, especially this one for some reason because there's no regenerating health. So it's like, well, fuck. But I, I will drop that in that hallway. I would love to see Brian play this game on like Superhuman. He will fucking get toasted. <laughs> I, I will like love that shit because Superhuman. If you think normal is like tough, superhuman is retarded from what I saw. There we go. Health bonus. <sighs> the fuck are you talking about, Sonata? Black retard brother. I don't know. I don't associate with that fam. Sorry. Smarter than the average bear. Oh, it's the long legs, of course. It's the stupid eggs, of course. Stop jumping around. That's one. Hopefully, too. These enemies are fucking annoying. They really are. Oh, shit. Let's see. Auger. What do we got in here? Hello. Man, this gun was so broken in the multiplayer. Oh my god. 
so goddamn broken. Oh, thanks for that. Oh, who you running up on? Who you running up on? Yes, I win. Because the auger, you can see through walls and you can put up a shield. And every goddamn time is like, okay, well, I can't break through that shit unless I like throw a grenade. And half the time people throw grenades like the hedgehog grenades or the giant grenade where it's like it sets the whole area on fire. And I'm like, bro, how cheap can you get? If they had like resistance multiplayer these days, I think people would understand where I'm coming from because I really hated the auger. Sniper rifle was pretty good too online. I'm so glad I got to play that shit because it was so fun. I think it was like the first one had 32 versus 32 players if I'm not too mistaken. Maybe and I think the second one had like 16 on 16. So that shit was like well ahead of mag. And I loved it. I love every bit of resistance multiplayer. But the broken guns come with the territory. Also, mini balls. I have no health. <laughs> Get behind something. I have no health. I might. I might take an L again. Oh, I can't sprint either. Wait. Wait. Give me a second, nigga. Let me drop this on you. Where is he? <gasps> mm, take that. Oh, wait, he has one too? What? Oh, well. I should have expected that, but whatever. Grenade. Oh, someone's behind me. The multiplayer was fun. Like I said, the only thing was Resistance has a lot of high-tech weapons. So you got to expect that shit to be broken sometimes because I think um you get a standard M4 uh and then you like or whatever they called it in World War 2 M1 carbine. I I don't fucking know. Uh my history on that is I think it was the M1 carbine. Uh, but then you would get a lot of high-tech weapons on the map. Yeah, the M1 Garen. Uh, I I'm so focused with trying not to die that I forgot my history. <laughs> Give me some health. Damn, come on. <laughs> I thought that shit wasn't going to be a problem, but... Now I can kind of see on harder difficulties, it will be. Uh. Where's the pub? Indicator, please. Because I don't want to... I don't want to go out there and get killed, you know? Shit. Oh, oh, I made it. I made it, nigga. I'm happy. No, like, okay. The fucking thing about the Joe debate is that he got triggered because I showed him that thread of uh, game facts. I'm extra black today, yes. Uh, but <laughs> I, I showed him, like, a thread on GameFAQs because he was making a point that, oh, well, people just hate on me on the internet for no reason. And I showed him, like, bruh, some of these people in here have, like, legit criticisms. Like, especially with your reviews. Because you went Total Biscuit and cut over your comments like a salty bitch. So I'm like, oh, the south? Uh, ah, this way. They're coming through this door. 
so it's like, okay, okay, Angry Joe, you cut off your comments because you can't handle when people tell you, you know, I really like your reviews, could you make more of them? Uh, and then it's like, the rapid fire stuff, I know it takes long, but the rapid fire stuff, no one cares about. Uh, because you seem to have shit opinions when you make quick videos. So I showed him this. He got mad, started bitching, got his girl to like fucking try to dox me and shit. And I just kept roasting him until he like blocked me. Then he unblocked me. I don't know, it's weird. Like people have this weird mentality to block then unblock. I'm like, what the fuck? Well, I mean, you already blocked me. So what's the point of unblocking? Oh, I'm gonna make myself look better because I, I, I unblocked you because I can't handle an argument. That shit's weird. Like, JTEC did that shit too. I'm like, man, when did I ever slander Spider Man for PS4? Like, where, where's the receipts? I'm pretty much hyped for that game. Why would I say, oh, I have a PC as well. I don't like Spider Man for PS4. I never said that. I'm getting that game day one. I never talk shit about Spider-Man. The only thing I said was that I'm not really feeling the whole, um, playing with other characters that are not super powered, uh, like Mary Jane. Like, I would rather play with Black Cat or Venom because I play Ultimate Spider-Man and I thought playing with Venom was the best part. That's not the, that's not to say though that there won't be other characters you can play with. So, I could be wrong. But I'm like this nigga. And then he blocked me again. I'm like, "All right. That's cool." I see him. They're moving in from the south. Okay, I'm glad I have like all this cover. Yeah, I like Ultimate Spider-Man. Some of the physics can be weird. I'm not gonna lie, like some of the physics for jumping and webbing can be a little bit odd, but it's a good game. Oh, they're inside. Ravagers? Oh no. I never played Web of Shadows. Always was interested to try that game. Because I like the whole fact of you could be good or evil. Like you could play with the black suit or you can pick like good choices like the standard suit. I really like that game. The way it looked and everything. I'm just surprised I never got the chance to really buy it. But now it's like there's really no excuse. So I can just buy it whenever. So I might buy it and live stream it one of these days it's a very interesting game add JTEC to the group oh no I'm not I'm not gonna be like that other podcast group that adds people that box I'm not a fraud so I'll, I'll take a rain check on that also the gore in this game is incredible a lot more gore compared to Resistance 2 and to some extent the first one. It's like there was like blood, a lot of blood, but I don't remember like heads being blown off. Yeah, it's like Spider-Man, you could pick either Black Cat or Mary Jane and it's like as a kid, why wouldn't Spider-Man want to get in Black Cat? Like, seriously, you know. Put the redhead aside for a bit and get some of that mocha latte vanilla ass. And that is Black Cat. I always thought Black Cat was hotter than Mary Jane. That's, that's crazy that, like, well, alright. Story-wise, I mean, if they can make Mary Jane interesting in Spider-Man for PS4, I will totally take back everything I said. I have no problem doing that. Uh, because I get tired of the whole, oh, I'm a damsel in distress. 
I need to be saved. Instead of being like, you know, a strong fucking female character. Uh, so I hope her being a lot more interactive with Spider-Man changes my opinion on that. Oh no! Also, I am fucked. Oh, he said, fuck that shield. No! Keep your bitch ass at bay. No! Fuck! Getting shocked! I don't like that, it's two of them! No! Oh no, okay. Hit him! I think I'm dead again. I did not expect to. I'm jumping downstairs! Fuck! Oh, dude! <laughs> oh, man. I did the smart move, but it didn't help. I'm a baked potato. I just saw that. What the fuck, Brandon? Okay, I have to expect there's two of those enemies with the electric stuff, so I have to get ready for those two in particular, but I think I'll be okay. I'm going to save the health pack in the corner and take more Ross, more ammo. I just want Mary Jane to be an interesting character in Spider-Man 4 PS4. No. Oh, Peter saved me. Like, maybe like once or twice, but not to the point where it's like annoying. Because then it's going to turn into like some escort mission shit. And I'm not a fan of those. <laughs> I'm really not. Like, remember Ashley Graham from fucking Resident Evil 4? Like, no. I don't want to do that. But if it's a character that can fight, like, I don't know, maybe Venom, little section, play as the bad guy, that will be lit. Also, I'm destroying the door, which is great, great idea. Great idea. He's in anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh, I got something for you. Hold on a second. There you go. Yeah, put that shield up. Oh, oh crap. I'm dying. Oh, in the corner is not a good sign. So let me pick up that health pack. Where was it? Yo, it's gone. That's weird. Oh, never mind. Oh, that's one. I hate that he can do... Well... I shouldn't hate it because, I mean, it makes sense that he can use the same abilities I can. Which is pretty interesting each time it happens. But I still hate that shit. I don't know what was worse. Uh, Resident Evil 4 with Ashley or Resident Evil 5 with dumb AI Sheva. I think sometimes... RE5 is worse because I tell Sheva not to use, like, uh, you just can't tell her not to use your, like, health items, man, and I hate that. She picks something up, you don't want her to use it, she uses it. It's like, oh my god, why, you dumb bitch? Like, I hate you, seriously. Why did you do that? I needed that, like, fucking herb, and you used it. Oh, I don't like Ashley either, so... I actually thought it was funny that at the end of Resident Evil 4, she implied that she wanted Leon's dick. I'm like, okay, I can, I can understand because... Tense situation. 
you gotta alleviate the stress but that just came left field to me I'm like damn bitch you the most annoying character in this game <laughs> and you want the D no you are denied D for denied I, I don't know about Moira Burton being the best girl though she's a a little try hard I must say I don't like her dialogue I mean the short hair is nice that is nice. Oh, did I glitch out for a sec? No, that's that's just how the cookie crumbles. All right, I'll go with that. Freedom fighters, yes. Hunnigan is cute. Uh, Ada's okay, but I'm not like I'm not too crazy over Asian girls. I mean. They are squeakers in bed, so I might have to pass. I don't want to, like, be drilling them. And then you hear some shit like, Oh, Ching Chong, Chinese, oh, no. And it's like, oh, my, what? Why, why are you doing this, fam? Why, why are you doing this? Oh man. We took a detour, showed up at Fort Benning, talked his way onto the base, broke into the commander's office. I'm gonna quote that on a resume. <laughs> Stop making fun of Tommy's people. You know, Brandon, if you weren't a mod, you would get timed out. I just I just will feel that will happen. <laughs> Cause Tommy's like, I'm not having any of this today. Oh, our, yo, it's another monkey fuck. All right. I fought this guy before earlier, by the way, so. Ah, he ran me over. Get up. Get up, son. Oh, my God. Harambe, you died in, like, fucking forever. Go back to hell. Oh, he's hurt. Oh, that's why it's good not to be so close. He can climb, all right. I'm about to die so bad. It's like so many enemies fight me at the same time. I'm <laughs> like, fuck. Silver spoon privilege individual. Check your privilege. Oh, let me save the auger then. If that's gonna be the case. If you're gonna do it like that. No more atomized rounds. Shit. That's fucking disappointing. Oh, he rolled up. Oh, run. Oh. Yes, get hedgehog. Oh, that's down there. Yeah, you can you can have fun with that. Oh. <laughs> Somebody got tired out. I knew it was coming. Hey, that's mod abuse, fam. I would classify that as mod abuse. Oh, no, no. He's angry, no shit. Damn it, Grunts got me again! Okay, so mid-battle, I have to expect that there are grunts that respawn, and again, I fucking hate respawning enemies, man. 
Ah, oh, the bane of my existence. Stay dead, please. Oh my god, this dude like fucking bitch slapped me. I beat your brother before he's dead. Fuck! Stop slapping me, you monkey bitch. Also, I kind of like. I don't know if I mentioned this before, but I kind of have to hold the loaf because my controller that I'm using right now, it is legit broken, so I cannot sprint. The L3 button does not work for me. Oh, health though, so I cannot sprint away. Otherwise, I would be running like a madman right now. Oh, where is that gun? The Ross Moore. Fuck it. Oh! I like that. Like a little bit of fall damage. Pretty cool. Well, not so cool in this situation because... This motherfucker is on my ass. Okay, now the forearm. Oh, yep, here they come, respawning enemies. Fuck you. Where's the hybrids? They are dead, I think. Oh, good job, AI. No, wait, bad job because you didn't get them all. You son of a bitch. Uh, where's the auger? Auger, auger! Oh, the dude's right behind me. Shit. Get up! I'm in a bad spot. Yeah, I'm gonna die. I'm in a bad spot again. I'm gonna die. I wish I could sprint away, but I can't. Oh! Oh, fuck that. Alright, this is it. My, my last stand. Uh, bullseye. Is he dead? Yes! Oh no! No you don't! No! Motherfuckers tried to come in and finish me off. That ain't happening. <laughs> that ain't happening. Alright, let's see. Where are we at in this crazy live stream? Okay, I played for an hour, so I think I'm gonna wrap it up here. Um, I'm just gonna try to get some healing in me. Try to get that heal and that fever. There we go. What's the next segment before I close off? Because I had fun. Oh. Also, it's funny how the first two games. They didn't feel like this game an actual resistance against fucking the alien swarm. Well, I guess you could say it did, but it had the whole military theme, which, you know, I mean, I, I like military shooters, but this game feels so much better because it's like, this is the final chance humanity has against the Chimera.
the other two games, it's like, I'm in the military, bitch. I can handle this shit. I have powers. Dude, resistance to the ending is so goddamn crazy. Nathan Hell has like fucking force powers. Also, I oh no, my video feed didn't die. I thought it died for a second. But yeah, you can like force push enemies to oblivion in the last like 30 seconds. And I'm like, my name's Charlie Tent. How the hell, how the hell do I have these powers and I didn't destroy Capelli? I told you, man. I told you this old bastard was going to get the gat. I told you. He fucking ran out of Viagra. And he's going to die. And there's nothing that he can do about it because he's like 90 years old. He's a fucking fossil. He's a T-Rex, a dinosaur, a brontosaurus rex nigga. He's going to be expired. And I told you he was going to die. That guy also looks like Elvis, which is, uh... All right, hell to the king, I guess. I'm guessing by virtue of the fact you're still breathing. Okay. Insomniac, if you guys are, well, I doubt you'll stumble across the live stream, but I'm telling you. All right, here's the deal. Make Resistance HD because the third game looks damn gorgeous on PS3. It looks so good. It needs to be remastered. I say the best games in the series, one and three, and then two is like, eh, still a good game, but has a lot of problems. Also, <laughs> repeat. <laughs> oh, I almost said review tech because I saw a video of his earlier, but uh, J Tech, they have the same name. Uh, fucking tech. Not the same name, but you know, they have tech in their name and shit, so... I saw a video from fucking Review Tech, that shit was just dumb. Okay, let's go over the plan one more time. This man knows nothing about PC gaming. And JTEC blocked me. I don't want to make no fucking Patreon, unless like... You know... Get someone like Zoll Burger to shake her ass, then yeah. I'll be rich every night. That's what you got to do on Twitch. We need like a IAS. We need like a IAS hooker. You know, so we can get like about fucking ten k subs. <laughs> I'm telling you, man. That shit just works every time, and I, I just guess people are so fucking thirsty that that shit just works, and Twitch just doesn't care. It's super weird. It's like, change the rules all you want. You're still gonna have fucking titty streamers, so it doesn't even matter. Alright, but I think that's how I want to end it, by roasting some thoughts. Uh, so I had fun, you know. It was a crazy random live stream, but I might see you guys next time with some Ultimate Spider-Man. I don't know what time I'm going to do it, but maybe like tomorrow morning. Uh, as always, if you guys have anything you want to send me, not any fucking news. I saw that in the chat, by the way. Please don't send me that. I will kill you. Uh, but if you want to send me anything on Twitter, it's going to be cool. Uh, I'm on Twitter at rentoperative underscore. I talk a lot, so it happens. I will see you guys next time. It was fun, and as always, take care.